Hello YouTube, Diecast Nation here, and today I'm going to be doing a review of the 2008 Mitsubishi Triton or L200 by Matchbox. Uh, so before I actually dive in depth and take a look at the 160 ACL model that's in front of you, uh, I'm actually going to give you guys a little bit of background on the the actual truck that this model is based off of. So the Mitsubishi Triton or L200 is a compact pickup truck manufactured by Mitsubishi Motor Company. It was originally released in 1978, uh, but this model here is the fourth generation of the Triton pickup truck and was released in 2006. Uh, so this truck is powered by a couple of turbo diesel four-cylinder, six-cylinder engines, as well as a couple of gasoline four-cylinder and six-cylinder engines. Uh, this truck is not sold in the United States. It's sold in other markets, such as Europe and South America. And there we go. That's a little bit of a brief background on the real-life, actual Mitsubishi, Mitsubishi Triton. Uh, but now we can actually take a look at this 160A scale model manufactured by Matchbox. Uh, so here it is. Obviously, as you can see, it's blue in color. Specifically, it's metallic blue. Uh, so this model that is made by Matchbox was originally released in 2009. That's when they first started making this model. Uh, but this one, the specific one that you're looking at, uh, was released in 2011 in the Service Center 5-pack series. So now we can actually take a look around the vehicle. So on the side here, we have these nice fender, gray plastic fender flares. I think those look very nice. My camera will focus here. I think that those fender flares look very, very nice. We have just simple chrome five-spoke wheels. Again, I think that's a very nice looking wheel. Obviously, we have door handle detail here. I like this curve of the back door. I think that's a nice stylistic element of the truck. Again, we have those fender flares back here. There's the tail light. It took a lot of time uh, painting in that red color, and there's actually some little white and gray elements to it there. Right here we have a reflector. In the back here we have the Mitsubishi logo right there in the center as well as a, uh, a handle to drop the tailgate and this particular model features a tow hitch so that you can tow various trailers. Pretty much the same thing on the op opposite side. We have a uh, some detail there for the fuel filler cap. Nice mirror details. Up top we have a sunroof. In the front of the truck we've got this nice grill here with the Mitsubishi logo in the center. Nice, very nice headlamp details. My camera will focus. There we go. Very nice headlight details there. We also have a number plate or license plate up front. It says heart, I heart my L200. <laughs> That's kind of a nice humorous element that Matchbox threw in there. We have some fog light details. And this, these windows, these plastic windows on this model are actually smoke in color. They're not clear. They're slightly tinted. And in the bed here, we've got a gray bed liner with a couple of uh, bags in there and a couple of uh, items in there that this person who would be driving this vehicle is hauling around. Obviously, this is a very short bed on this truck because it is a, a four-door pickup truck. We do have running boards. And on the bottom, it says copyright 2009 Mattel Incorporated. This model is made in Thailand. And right there it says Mitsubishi L200 slash Triton 2008. And as I already said, this is a 168 scale model of the actual truck. We have some nice driveline details and differential detail back here. So that's pretty nice. And overall, I like this model quite a bit. Uh, I think that the truck in general is just a very nice looking vehicle. 
Uh, it's not the nicest looking, uh, but for a compact pickup truck, I think it's pretty nice looking. Uh, I do like the color. This metallic blue is a really, really nice looking color. It really makes the truck stand out. Uh, another thing I really like is the fender flares. I think that those add a lot of style and interest, visual interest to the truck. And overall, this is a pretty nice Matchbox vehicle. Uh, it's definitely worth picking up for you know how you know how cheap Matchbox vehicles are. So I would recommend picking one of these up. And yep, that's my review of the Mitsubishi Triton or L200 by Matchbox. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for more videos. Thanks.